Responding to emergencies. Helping citizens recover following a disaster. Those are two of the primary functions of Wisconsin Emergency Management. However, lives can be saved and property spared through mitigation measures that can prevent damage from occurring. That's the goal of Wisconsin Emergency Management's mitigation program. It's a program that provides grants to state and local governments for mitigation measures that will reduce the impact from future disasters. You really want to look at what are the hazards that face our communities, how high is that risk, and what am I going to do to reduce that risk? Then develop a strategy and then that will set you up to apply for funding to actually implement those projects in your community. Flood damage is the perfect example of damage that can be mitigated. Because floods are likely to occur in the same place on multiple occasions, it makes sense to keep improved properties out of those flood zones. The object here is to make sure that federal, state, and local governments, as well as property owners and insurance companies, don't have to pay for repairs to the same properties over and over again. Wisconsin Emergency Management's priority for funding is for acquisition and demolition of flood-damaged or flood-prone properties. By removing the structures, we eliminate future damages, and the vacated properties can be used for open space uses, like this park in Darlington. There has been a study that was done that showed for every dollar that we spend in mitigation, that we actually can save $4 in future disaster damages, and actually for flooding, it's $5. In some cases, like here in Soldiers Grove, homes may be elevated to prevent future flood damage. In other areas, detention ponds are built to keep high waters from causing damage. Another mitigation measure is the safe room, a building or room specially constructed meeting specific building standards to keep people safe from tornadoes and severe high winds. Safe rooms can be residential or community safe rooms, like this one in the town of Dunn. I think they will become very popular and I think they're a good idea, especially in mobile home parks or areas like think of fairgrounds and campgrounds where people are very vulnerable. Wisconsin Emergency Management responds to disasters, but the highly successful mitigation program helps to prevent future damages and save lives. <laughs>